The following contest is a six-man Hell in a Cell match. And representing the Rock and Sock Connection from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 275 pounds, The Rock! A man who has spearheaded one of the most memorable errors of WWE, taking over Hollywood and served as a prototype for what it is to be a superstar. It's okay, Byron. You're not the only one in awe of The Rock's presence. The Rock has an aura like no one else. And from Victoria, Texas, weighing in at 252 pounds, the WWE Undisputed Champion, Stone Cold Steve Austin! Look out, here comes Stone Cold Steve Austin. The roof nearly blew off this place once the sound of that glass shattering hit. The game is here. And from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 260 pounds, the WWE Champion, This is Triple H's world. The spotlight is his home. A Grand Slam champion. A yeah, former European champion, former Intercontinental champion, tag team champion, and WWE champion. Triple H is right where he belongs in the spotlight with the eyes of the WWE Universe fixated squarely on his chiseled physique. We're talking about one of the most effective, methodical technicians to ever lace up a pair of boots. I just hope Triple H's opponent tonight is as mentally tough as they think they are because the cerebral assassin is at the top of the game. The Cerebral Assassin! Antonio, Texas, weighing in at 200. 
Mr. WrestleMania. Shawn Michaels has earned every single moniker bestowed upon him in his career. You are looking at one of the greatest of all time. Oh, for the love of... And representing the Rock and Sock Connection, weighing in at 287 pounds, Mankind! One of my finest moments was calling this man's WWE Championship win. I said it then and I still mean it today. Mankind has achieved his dream and the dream of everyone else who's been told you can't do it. And that dream continues to this day. And on top of that, this match will undoubtedly have a big impact on where these guys stand in the next WWE.com power rankings. And there's been so much upward movement from new faces over the past few weeks that dropping more than 10 spots following a loss isn't necessarily out of the question.
It's not on a cell, so we know there are no disqualifications or counts. You can only walk out of that demonic structure a winner via pinfall or submission. Or how it sell is one of the most brutal and dangerous matches in the history of WWE. Just look through the annals of history to see what havoc has been wrought in that steel cage enclosure. Well, they call it Hell in a Cell for a reason. It was easy, they'd call it Picnic in the Park or something. But your point is well taken, Byron. Victory must be won inside the ring, and anything not nailed to the ground can be used as a weapon. This is where the dark forces of evil are unleashed. Love it fancy here. Oh, man. The Undertaker is not someone to sleep on. Stomping down! Uh-oh. High angle, belly of back suplex. This is some great offense by Shawn Michaels. Mankind is pulling out all the stops here. Ooh! Boom! K.O. Punch! Boom! What a forearm! There are all sorts of things he can do to an opponent after a takedown like that. I never had much use for this kind of showboating, but mankind's his own kind of animal. You ain't cheating, you ain't trying. Oh, man, I hope the Undertaker's okay. Oh, yeah, here's the rock. What offense Shawn Michaels is showing at this point. Ooh, what impact. Harsh impact. Boom, what impact. Oh, the Lord punch. Boom. <laughs> Undertaker is a force within the ring. Oh, face! Oh, oh Triple H is on the attack now. Oh! Love it fancy here. Big break and back break up. He may get the three count right here! I think so! Well, that was a close call. Well, if you doubted that Steve Austin was a tough SOB, I think your questions have been answered. Bang! Right in the face! Well, heavy duty right here. Michael's voice sound up! making his statement as we speak. Wow! Oh, oh, God! Bokina Crouch! Uh-oh, got him in the sleeper! Is he gonna pass out? The drama ball! The Rock, can he hold on? This is bull! He breaks it, I can't believe it. So unbelievable that he broke out of that. Nothing fancy here. Back breaker and back breaker. Oh, look at this. Look at the suplex off the top rope. Oh, jeez. Oh, Take all the wind out of you. Steve Austin's face. Oh, what a forearm. Check your face after that one. Inside the ring now. Wow, what impact. There he goes. He through the wall. My God. 
a human body is not built to take that kind of abuse. The offense of the Rock is working well right now. Oh, man, what a strike. Check out Steve Austin's offense. Wow, Mankind gets the reversal. We might just be witnessing the end of the abdominal stretch. It's locked in. This is a great way to wear down your opponent. Is this what he needs for the win? You get dropped like that. You don't get up. Period. Look at Taker here. The away slam. Oh, what a long way down. Nothing chop. Flatline. breaking down out here near the steel structure. Look, Triple H is on the attack now. Systematic destruction. Taking the more punishment to his head. And the effects of assaults like this have a way of adding up in a hurry. Few 
seconds longer, and this match would have been over. Uh-oh, we know what's next. Pedigree! Shoulders down, this could be it. Oh, and he breaks up the pin. Taker has him up. Stone. Pile driver. Into the pin attempt. There's two. The Undertaker gets the W. The Undertaker wins it. The devil was afoot in this Hell in a Cell match. Let's take another look, guys. That was a big win for him right there. Wow, he absolutely manhandled him there toward the end. And a big thank you to everybody watching WWE's Hell in a Cell on the WWE Network. What an amazing match we just witnessed.